As we move deeper into 2023, details about the upcoming Galaxy S24 range are starting to surface. Earlier this year, the Galaxy S23 series brought a significant improvement for European users by using a Snapdragon processor instead of an Exynos chip. However, there are hints that Samsung may revert to using Exynos chips in Europe after just one year, which could be disappointing news for Galaxy users in the region. Leaker Ice Universe, who's as reliable as they come with Samsung Info, published a tweet saying he's 100% sure that the Exynos 2400, a new high-end chipset currently being developed by Samsung, will be adopted in Europe. While the tweet doesn't specifically mention the Galaxy S24, it came in a flurry of tweets the leaker made about Samsung's upcoming flagship, so it's not hard to connect the dots here. According to the same thread, the Exynos 2400 might have a top clock speed of 3.16 GHz on its most performant core, with other cores clocked at 2.9 GHz, 2.6 GHz, and 1.95 GHz. This leaker has previously talked about other details regarding the Galaxy S24 series, including potential information about the Galaxy S24 Ultra screen. He also went on to mention that all models in the range will come with an ultra-bright screen that can peak at 2,500 nits, Regarding this Exynos rumor, it's not the first time we've heard it by any means, and while nothing is certain, it's definitely starting to pick up steam. The news of Samsung moving to Snapdragon chips in Europe for its flagships was widely celebrated. Over the last few years, the Exynos variants of Galaxy S devices was almost always worse than the Snapdragon variants sold in the Americas and other markets. And as detailed on XDA, the Exynos variant of the Galaxy S22, the last generation to come with an Exynos chip in Europe, could get particularly problematic. It could be that Samsung gave Exynos a one-generation break to polish things up, but after the Snapdragon move was widely seen as a positive one, this seems odd, to say the least. Of course, this is just a rumor, so take it with a grain of salt. But if Samsung does end up releasing the Galaxy S24 with an Exynos chip, we'd love it if Samsung proved the haters wrong with Snapdragon-level performance. That remains to be seen, though. That's it for today. What are your thoughts on this? Let me know in the comment section. As always, see you in the next video. Peace out.